Stationary support, young and wild and free, and tiny titans, guys. Please. I'm level four. I pre-leveled. I have two fortune. Please. Please, man. Please. I'm begging you, man. I'm begging you, please. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, man. Six. Okay, three is fine. Three is fine. Thank you, man. I love you. <laughs> I'm unlucky for the last four hours, man. Finally a good game. Finally a good game. <laughs> is everyone is everyone committing stuff? Is everyone committing stuff? Okay, I think everyone's committing stuff. We want to go on a fat loss streak, of course. I mean, this guy is still stronger than me, right? Because he has so much heavenly. He has four heavenly. I think he beats me because, like... Timo, Timo does so little single target damage, right? Because he keeps spreading his poison to everyone. So he's not gonna kill a single unit, right? Like, he's not focus firing one guy. And sure, she's okay. I mean, I hope we get uh, one more kill here. Oh, frick, okay. Please lose, please lose. Oh, she's gonna do a lot of damage. Uh, please lose, please lose. She's gonna ult. Ult, ult, ult. Nice, good job. Nice! Let's go. Perfect loss. Perfect loss with Tiny Titans. Good stuff. Good stuff. Good stuff. Let me just uh, get rid of this from the last game. Okay. So, Fortune. We rolled a three first. We will at least raise it twice. Or, like, push the luck twice, right? So, we get a very big cash out. Let's see. So, this guy... Okay. So, this guy is also weak, man. What are they doing? Why do you take Silver Spoon and then do nothing? Doesn't that make no sense? That makes no sense, right? I'm gonna sell that. There was one with, with three units only. There was one guy with three units, guys. So I wanna sell. Yeah, look at this guy. I wanna sell, man. I have to sell. It's so sad, though. Why are they doing that? Uh, what is happening? You're not supposed to go on a lost streak early game, guys. Like, I could have killed this if I didn't sell the Rek'Sai, but I have to, right? The guy is just griefing completely. Uh, yeah, as I'm saying, like, I, I, I don't think you're supposed to uh, go on a lost stream. Like, only if you have fortune. For five rounds, Darius transforms champions on highlighted bench slots into random ones. Uh, whatever, man. Alright, the question is... Like, bro, what, what, what are they doing, man? Like, this guy, four units. This guy has four units now as well. Is he gonna sell them? Not really, right? He's rerolling two costs. He wants Senna three. Oh, that's good. I think I can play Bruiser, man. He's five units now. I think I should be fine. Like, again, you're not supposed to go on a Lost Streak usually now because they nerfed the Lost Streak gold so much, right? So usually everyone tries to play their best, their strongest board nowadays. So, um, yeah, not sure what they're doing there. They're trying to just get as much money as possible interest rate, I guess, but yeah. Alright, this guy, four units, or... Uh, I think he had five units, but we get a four unit loss, so we killed one. That's good, that's great. Okay, now we push our luck again after this carousel. Mm, we have to pivot into an AP comp. AP comp is what we pivot into. Ideally, we pivot into a level 9 comp. I, I think I can, but what if I can't? I mean, if I can't, I'm getting so much items and stuff. That doesn't matter. Also, I'm last pick. Yeah, I forgot that I'm last pick. I was trying to pick because I lost every fight. I was like, oh, I'm first pick, but yeah, I have, I have tiny titans. Of course, we're last pick. I'm just gonna take the three cost and you deny Aphelios from the enemies. That's good. Yeah. Denying Aphelios is really good. Push our luck. Six. Six. What the frick? I mean, it doesn't matter. It doesn't really matter. Okay, we have Sunfire or like we have um, we have an armor piece for tank. We probably go Morello. Morello, Morello, Shoujin, Huey, something like that. Huey would be ideal. What is Exalted? I really like Exalted Orn. Very good. I really like Orn Lux. Uh, Lux is playable though if you play two star Lissandra. 
Okay, level four. At level five, I mean. Level five enemy. Pretty, pretty strong right there. I'm not gonna kill a single unit. Oh, freaking kill him. Good job, Tristana, man. Let's go. Good freaking job, man. Am I supposed to roll this? Like, sell both? Nah, I don't want to sell two, uh, one, uh, two Kabukus. I need two-star Kabuko. I need... Uh, I need... A Fortune Emblems, right? That would be sick. Five, nice. Good. Very good. Two-star Tristana. It's not even needed, right? Freak this. Freak this, we're just losing. We're just losing the fights. Okay, I mean scouts. Strong enough. Strong enough. Strong enough. Too strong. Please don't fight this guy. I can't kill a single unit. Here I can kill Riven. Am I fighting that guy? Classic, guys. Can't kill a single unit. It's fine, though. Probably can't kill a single unit most of the time. Roll this guy into two-star Kabuko. Wait, did we kill a unit? Or am I crazy? No, we didn't, right? No, we didn't. What was... What was... What was... Being thrown? That There was like a boomerang coming from... Oh, because of the trick shot, yeah. The ricochets. I was like, oh, is my... Is my Tristana throwing a boomerang? Yeah, she wasn't. Okay, Morello, Shujin, Bramble. Two-star Kabuko. This thing is pretty good, but I lose the fight with this. Do I, do I lose the fight with this? Do I lose the fight with this team? I don't think so, right? Kabuko can tank enough. This should be good enough. This should be good enough. The thing is, we have, like, no damage. Ah, bro, I hope I'm fine, man. What the frick is this? Nah, we're fine. We're fine. We're fine. We're freaking fine. Yeah, we're okay. Look what you made me do! As you wish. Okay. Um, new bruiser. I could level here. I could just pre-level. Uh, crit glove is freaking trash. I'll keep it a buck. Morello, steadfast heart, right? Morello, steadfast heart. Ionic spark. Okay. Morello, steadfast heart. Ionic spark. I have a random. The thing is, I shouldn't be playing this Morgana because Morgana doesn't really focus fire one unit. Oh, I don't think we win this, right? Sorry, Kabuko is a little bit risky. Nah, we're good, man. Yes, Crown Guard. Nice, we killed the unit as well. Perfect. Perfect, let's go. Oh, frick, we killed two units! Crazy, bro! Nice! Two unit loss! What? Okay, GG. Uh, Bruiser Crown. Bruiser Crown. Not even that bad, honestly. Makes the pivot easy, but uh, it's not that good, man. Ah, uh, Bruiser Crown is not it. Lucky Gloves. Lucky Gloves is pretty good. Thing is, I'm gonna get so many items, it's not even that good. Honestly, it's pretty good. It's easy for the transition as well. Prismatic Ticket. I'm not gonna go for a reroll comp. Uh, Impenetrable Bulwark is also really good. I feel like it's just Lucky Gloves, bro. I mean, now it's just too easy, no? Like, it's not even good. It's not even good, guys. It's too easy now. Is it even fun? Is it even fun now? Is it actually fun now, guys? Yes, it is, man. Of course it's fun! I'm having the time of my life over here, man! Okay, I hope I'm not too strong. I don't think I am. Like, the enemies are actually putting items, right? I'm not put using a single item. I wanna, I wanna unclutter my bench, make it a little bit easy to transition afterwards. I have a double titan, guys. Because uh, tiny titans, at first, right? 
And then I send her a picture. And then she realizes it's the tiniest titan. <laughs> you smell me, guys? Like, she realizes it's the tiniest titan. So, so she gave me this. So she gave me this. Unfortunate, guys. Sorry, guys. I tried my best. Alright, anyway. Um, yeah, we just go level 9, right, eventually? We can just pre-level again. Uh, we should be strong enough. Like, I'm not using any of my stuff, bro. I'm not using any of my stuff, man. Okay, so that means I can get a Giga Cash Out. What, what is the maximum Cash Out? 250, right? 250 is the maximum Cash Out. At that point, you get either, like, 250 Gold or a 3-star Legendary. It has 50% chance to give you a 3-star Legendary. But how do you get 250, man? Like, 250 is only possible with 7 Fortune, I think. Like, low-key. Lesser Champion Duplicator. That doesn't do anything for me. I think I'm just gonna go for the Shoujin. I have a Shoujin now. I'm definitely going fast 9, right? I'm gonna be Giga Rich. I'm 70 health still. I mean, I can raise well into stage 4-5 and then 4-5 just cash out and get a... get a... Um, get level 9 and just... yeah. But I, I don't think I can get um, two, 250, man. I don't think I can get 250. Like, I think it's only with 7 Fortune. Because 7 Fortune allows you to get the same amount of stacks as if you're lost streaking, but for a win streak. Like, you can just start winning with 7 Fortune and you can keep pushing your luck and keep getting it. And that's how you get the, you know, the Giga Cash Out, usually. I'm buying some of the units that will be useful. Maybe I should buy Exalted, but uh, I don't think I'm playing. I really own everything together. Yeah, I'm just playing my standard level 9 comp with like a Zier, Huey and stuff. I think just standard level 9 comp, man, is easy as brick. Shall we cheers, my friends? Shall we cheers, my friends, guys? Uh, what else am I supposed to play? Oh, yeah, Lilia. This stuff. I like this the most. This is just easy, comfy. You get an AP from Heavenly from the Soraka, you get attack speed from Heavenly. You get um, Altruist, so you get resistances on everyone. And you can just add in Diana. You have three, three Mythic, you have two Behemoth, two Invoker. You just have everything. Zier grants six free rerolls that last until used. Uh, push your luck again. Okay, so if we get like a six here, we can die. Okay, five should be good. Five should be good. I'm not gonna use them now. But I might roll for any, but I don't think I should roll for any, because that just wastes money that I could roll a 9. So I don't think I'm supposed to roll for any. Because I need any for 5 um, fortune, and she's not gonna raise the amount of cash out I get. It's just gonna give me 3 player health every turn. So any can save me a lot of health. 5 times uh, 3 is 15, right? So 15 health can any save if I go level 8 now and roll to 0 to try to find an any. That's the only thing that it really saves. Everything else doesn't matter. So as long as I'm not dead anyway with these five, I'm fine. But I probably have to roll a little bit for any. I probably have to roll a little bit. Five was a little bit unlucky there, man. We won at four. Four would have been perfect. Because I can't die with four. I'm still healing two per, per turn though, with Tidiest Titan. So I'm gonna be 51. Like it's it's I think it's still fine. I need four more losses now. And I'll have like 60 health for four losses. It's not that bad. I think. I think it's not that bad. I can play altruist. Ooh, I'm getting a little bit nervous though, guys, because we might die. I don't know if I'm supposed to roll for any. Like, I'm pretty sure I'm supposed to go level 9. Yeah. 
pretty sure I'm supposed to go level 9, bro. Okay, I got Rabadons. That's really good, actually. Maybe I'm supposed to use some items as well. <laughs> Guys, I think rolling for any just throws the game. Then I'm hard stuck level 8. <sighs> but if I want to do it, I have to do it now, right? To get more health out of it. Four more, four more fights. I have 50 health. I think I'm just supposed to give her items. She can do a little something. I mean, I do want Dionic Spark, right? I mean, it doesn't matter, man. Just save HP, man. Just save HP, I think. The thing is, 50 health is fine. I just go level 9 here. I level to 9 and I'm not gonna die fat hard enough. 38 health, 38 health, so 40 health, and I need three more losses. 40 health, three more losses. I, how much did I just lose? I lost uh, 13, right? I lost 13 for a really bad loss. For a really freaking bad loss, I just lost 13. Cyber, cyber is good. Cyber is good. Both cybers are good. Which cyber is better? Probably bulk. Cyber bulk is good here. No, of course can't go egg. Like, what? Guys, come on, man. Use your freaking brain, guys. The frick is egg. I'm pretty sure this is better instead of trick shot. We have no... We only have magic damage. Or like, we, we, we don't have any items on the girl. This gives me altruist and everything. I just want some decent losses. I think I just use this on her. Get some better losses. Because at this point, if someone loses against me, they're freaking trolling, right? I have 70 gold in the bank. In this rank, no one's gonna lose. Like, the, the, okay, this guy is really weak though. What the frick is this? Okay, nah, 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 nah. Should be fine. I mean, if I win, I win, right? It is what it is. If I win, I win, bro. I have to, I have to. Oh, please, please, Morgana, one more ult. No, so unlucky. Look at these health bars, man. Just kill these five and I'm safe. So what is it, two more? Two more now. I mean, we can win the last one, you know? Even if we win the last one, we get a big cash out. It's only gonna nerf the cash out by a little bit, right? Even if we win the last one, it's still a big cash out. One, two, three, you know? Four. Uh, wait, how much did I just lose now? How much did I just lose now? Did I lose 13 HP again? Did I just lose 13 HP again? Okay, so I'm pretty safe. And then I can... I just need to stabilize instantly in one turn. I think I can do that. Because I'm gonna stabilize next turn already. Because I'm, I'm leveling here, right? I'm for sure leveling next turn. I'll have like 40 gold to roll. That can already give me some legendaries. For sure rolling next turn. Okay, th this time I lost more. I lost 14, right? Or no? At 27, yeah. I lost I lost quite a bit this time. But this time was a really one, two, three, four, five, six. Six unit loss. So against level eight player, I need to kill two units. I need to kill two units against a level eight player to survive. We might die. We might die, guys. We might die. But if we get any, we don't die, right? We heal at the start of the fight with any, right? After player combat, and here it's at the start. At the start of each player combat. Okay, so if we just play any, we heal three. So I heal three now. Oh, yeah, I'm chilling. Oh, yeah, I'm chilling for sure now. 
Okay, I, I can't. I can't. 18 is not one shotable. You can't get one shot at 18. And we still lose this one, but I just need to be fast now on the transition. Um. Am I keeping this? Not really. Oh, frick, I won. Okay. So we lose some stacks, but that's okay. We still get a big one. Aw, oh, man, that was kind of close that I just won. <laughs> we got the funniest one. <laughs> we got the funniest one, man. We got the freaking funniest one, legit. That's so funny. Legit the funniest one. Legit the funniest one, bro. That is so funny. It's a really bad one, though, if you think about it. I don't think I'm supposed to go steadfast on him. I mean, I have Udyr pair, right? I'm printing Udyr. Holy, that is funny. That is hilarious. I need a Zir. That's so funny, bro. Should I, shouldn't I just play a full... Um, shouldn't I just play... <laughs> I can't believe that's a cash out. I actually cannot believe that this is a cash out. That is a, by far the funniest cash out in the game, no? I actually cannot believe that is a cash out, bro. That's hilarious, man. So, basically, you get double radiant thingy, right? So it's 4,400 health on each dummy, and he can squat the dummies, so he gets bonus attack damage for each 1,000 health that he squats at the start of the fight. He only did it twice, and he, only ha he already has 34% bonus attack damage. It's so freaking funny, man. Okay, I mean, I need to play Fated, right? I need to play some Fated at least. Honestly, do I need to play Fated though? Like, I, I feel like playing Fated here is very scuffed. I mean, this is definitely Warden. I play this girl, that's fine. Uh, I just kick this for Fated, I guess. Or I just kick this guy. I mean, I'm chilling, right? There's no way I lose. Uh... It's a little bit annoying, though. I wanted Edge of Night on the set. I mean, even just the two Radiant freaking dummies, right? <laughs> the two double Radiant dummies are so funny, right? Like, they're already so tanky. I think I just win anyway, right? But, like, uh, I'm trying to still play it clean and not mess it up. Okay, I don't think I'm playing this exact content. So, I'm trying to include some Fated, right? So if we want to include some Fated, we want to basically... I mean, the thing is, Altruist is so good, though. Stick to the plan. I feel like Altruist is too good. Do we just play without Fated? Fated is just 15% Omnivamp for him, you know? It's not really that big of a deal. It's really not that big of a deal, man. I feel like. And think about it. Altruist is freaking bonus... Resistances, right? Ten bonus resistance for the whole team. Ten resistances on these stupid dummies, right? That's also good. Yeah, I don't think I'm playing Fated. It just doesn't fit the team, man. I'm pretty sure I'm just playing around this this Huey. I'm just gonna duplicate him, by the way. I'm playing around Huey. I'm just kicking Nico. I just need to kick Nico for uh, the other unit that I was looking for. Or like Wukong. Kick Nico for Wukong, call it day. The set is just gonna deal a lot of damage just by being Warden. Just by having the Warden trait. This guy's three star freaking Aphelios. I might lose this fight, which is really annoying, to be honest. But yeah, I need to roll down, I need to roll down. Ah, uh, bro, classic three star Aphelios. So cringe, man. Ah, uh, it's just so broken. Like, is it, is it really supposed to be this broken, though? Also, I have this for a bull. I need to use this for bull, guys. Need to use this for bull. Alright, that guy is really strong now. Ooh. 
I mean, I have a two-star Udir now. Surely we don't lose, right? He has a Radiant Deathblade on, on Kai'Sa. <laughs> I hope I'm fine, guys. I hope I'm fine, bro. I think I am, though. Like, how do I not have two-star Hui yet? I need to keep rolling for two-star Hui. I was gonna go level 10. Oh, I probably should have spread the items uh, steadfast on Orn for Cyberbulk. Yeah, I forgot I had Cyberbulk. I'll keep it a stack. I need to. I need to. Two, I need to two star one of them and then use the duplicator on this, on the last one. Two star both ideally and then use the duplicator of the Huey, the painting. Maybe there is a two star. There is. Yeah. Oh please, man. Let me have that, please, bro. Nice. That's huge, guys. Okay, we have two star. Two star is here. We have Edge of Night on fe on, on set. He currently has 85% bonus attack damage, so that's getting crazy. He's gonna do do a ton of damage late game. Uh, the longer it goes, right? He's scaling super hard. And then we just need um, two star Huey now. Two star Huey, bro, please. And then I just duplicate the the, the freaking monkey. I think I have to roll, bro. Nice! Huge! There we go. Now we're good to go. Now we should be good to go, guys. Okay. Now we should really be good to go. Should be good. Okay, so now I just level for monkey, right? We get heavenly. Yeah, we get Heavenly. That's not bad. But just Heavenly for the monkey. Is that even worth? It's just Heavenly. I feel like usually I have a little bit of Sage, you know? Ah, well. We didn't get any... We didn't get any Tactician's Crowns, bro. I'm telling you... I'm telling you this cash out is not that good. This cash out is not that good. Because usually with Fated, you're very low HP. What the frick is this? Show me the back. Usually with Fated, you're very low HP, right? Is it is it is it this over Altruist? It's a two-star monkey. I, I think it is because it's a two-star monkey, right? A two-star monkey is a two-star monkey, bro. I think I, I think I gotta go for the two-star monkey. But Altruist is for sure broken. Maybe we just shouldn't play this guy, man. It's just Invoker and Dryad, which doesn't do much. Does Cyberbulk work on the dummies? It does, yeah. That's the funny, that's the even more funny, right? Nah, but I'm telling you, this cash out isn't even that good. Like, compared to other cash outs in this tier, like, there's probably like triple Tactician's Crown and stuff like that, right? That's obviously much better. But this is, uh, this is a funny one. But I can already see this happening in a tournament and someone losing because of it. Because, like, you're solo HP and you get a scaling cash out, right? Like, if you have 60 health left, yeah, sure, I can see this being one of the better ones. Because you just scale up, right? You win for like he's gonna he's gonna be so strong eventually. Okay, 16 health is already two life points again. That's good. Ah, uh, we just want to go level nine. Play this. Level nine. Play this. Call it a day. Yep. Easy peasy. That's our board, yeah. We just have this guy additionally in it instead of Diana at level 10, right? Usually I play Diana. She gives us. Dragon Lord and um, Sage, which is really nice for these AP. All the like, all your units are AP, right? All your backline units are AP, so it's really good. Good job, everyone. That's probably the comp I have the most first places with. Of course, you cannot always go for it. Um, okay, I definitely want uh, adapt. Uh, I definitely want Cyber Bulk on Orn, right? Cyberbulk on Orn and just print more items, right? I'm pretty sure if he prints an item for Wukong, for example, he gets Cyberbulk. The Wukong gets Cyberbulk, I think. So just do this. Infinite Frontline, the Hue also heals them. We win the game for free, basically. Hopefully, right? <laughs> they have some backline axes, like the Kai'Sa player. I'm a little bit terrified of the Kai'Sa player. He can hit the backline with his uh, bounces, right? He has four trickshot. Luckily, he doesn't have the augment that gives him another trickshot bounce. The set is really look at look at the set damage. 
This set just goes crazy right now, man. Uh, 157% bonus attack damage. <laughs> that is the most mind-blowing cash out in the game. That is truly the most fun one. Seriously. Hilarious, guys. Based. Very based. Are the Ord items random? No, they are, they are like Lucky Gloves items. They're very good. But he doesn't print that many of them, right? He uses a lot of mana for his ult. But they're very good. They're very good. I like the way he's designed, you know? Like, remember, uh, Kiana would print a billion items, right? But she would be um, designed in a way where, you know, she just gives you the items from the enemies. And you would just get some random freaking items, right? It was eh. But here, this guy, you know when he ults, he's gonna give you a strong item. Like, he's gonna give this... Look, he gives him Hodge, which gives him lifesteal now, which is pretty nice. Look. He's gonna lifesteal up now. With his tiger form, look. He's not dying. It's pretty good. But honestly, I might lose this. This guy is really strong and has a really tanky Udyr. Yeah, the set is freaking trash, guys. Yeah? We lose this, man. Our cash out is trash. I might knock it first. I might get third. Our cash out is freaking trash, what can I say? Really, bro? I'm missing one gold? I'm missing one gold? I think I have to level. I think Lilia is not doing much, right? I think this guy isn't doing much. Give me a new Azir, please. Heart is empty without empathy. That's pretty sad. Uh, we need the Altruist. Altruist gives us so much resistance. This is a broken trade. I might not even play Azir. Frick it, just play... Um, the thing is, Azir gives our guy uh, Dryads, which is at this point 150 bonus health, which isn't bad. I might just play Riven if I could find her for even more altruist. If I can find Riven, I'll play her. If I don't find a new Azir, the Azir has no items, right? So it's, it's like, eh, it's fine. Oh, Umbral is good. Sage Emblem, he wants it. I mean, yeah, it's not bad. I, th I think Umbral is really good for me, for the, for the guy. Okay, this is good already. Positioning is fine. If I get double two-star guy... Ah, never mind. I think this is good. Okay, I don't know, bro. I, I feel like I'm getting out positioned because I was too dizzy. I was too dizzy, bro. He put Udyr right here. But I feel like my Udyr can kick his Udyr as well, right? My Udyr can kick his Udyr. Like a boss, please. They're jerking each other off. Nice. Okay, they're in the back line. That's good. I have Umbral now on the set. But I like the set is just trash, bro. I feel like I would be stronger if I just wouldn't play the set. If I would just play Diana, you know? The enemy Udyr is so strong, guys. Look at this, look at this guy. Oh, nice. We won. We won this fight, though. That's good. Do we have ghostly? No, right? We're playing Sage. Is this better? I mean, Invoker is better than Sage, I think. We already have enough AP, right? We have enough AP, but it Sage gives Omnivamp. Sage gives Omnivamp in the front line. Maybe that's better. Instead of Invoker. I feel like my 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 team is about, yeah. Warden. I could kick this guy, but that, that loses me mythic. Which is definitely bad, right? I'm just gonna keep it here. It worked, so why why cancel it? Positioning works, so why stop it, right? Positioning works, so why stop it? Oh, now we're in our side of the map. Oh, frick. Wait, what is he doing? Why is he just... Why is he refocusing on my guy? Oh, these, these Udyrs are so stupid. I, okay, I mean, this is not my fault. He refocuses on my dude, you know? Yeah, this is not really my fault. 
I feel like. Because we have the same exact positioning almost. I mean, the Udyrs were in the same spot. Last fight, my Udyr went here. This time, his Udyr went, goes here. It is what it is, guys. I don't really understand how this Udyr unit works, man. I, yeah, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I don't know, guys. I don't know. I think um, this is a cash out the diff. Because this double, this cash out was not that good. You can see the set didn't do that much. It was a funny one. I'm happy it happened because it's really good YouTube content. But we can all agree that like a triple or even double tactician's crown with like maybe uh, like w w that, that was a really high cash out. That was like halfway through to the, to the max cash out, right? And the max cash out is a three star legendary or 250 gold, right? So I feel like it's at least two Tactician's Crowns or like two Radiant Items or even three Tactician's Crowns or two Tactician's Crowns, one Radiant Item, stuff like that. Or like three Tactician's Crowns, some gold, like stuff like that, right? I don't know the table by heart, but um, yeah. Probably some crazy stuff there. I would bet that this one was the worst one if you're just trying to win the game, right? But we'll take it, guys. Like, this guy was just stronger. I don't know. He had some lucky gloves and stuff as well, right? So he has more items on his front line. Yeah, his Udyr is just stronger as well, right? His Udyr is really strong with Titans. And he has Dragon Claw on Udyr. Yeah, we'll take it, guys. Subscribe and hit the bell if you enjoy these TFT videos. Also, make sure to leave an algorithmic comment and an algorithmic like down below to support this video in the algorithm so I can get some more views. And I'll see you next time.